amassing a long has been planned to mark one year since the Manchester terror attack at an Ariana Grande concert. The tribute will take place on May 22 to remember the 22 victims of the terror attack when a bomber detonated his suicide vest in a foyer at the Manchester Arena. Manchester City Council announced on Monday that the free event would be held in Albert Square and across the region to remember the dead and injured. The 22nd May event, titled Manchester Together, with one voice, will be a united act of remembrance, the council said. Officials are seeking choirs, community groups and schools to sing songs that evoke pride and solidarity. The BBC said the final 30 minutes of the sing-along will be broadcast on BBC Radio Manchester. Coming together in song will once again demonstrate that remarkable sense of togetherness, council leader Sir Richard Lees told the broadcaster. It is a fitting way for us to honour those who went full of joy to a music concert but never came back, or saw their lives changed forever. In a separate event, the council has called for suggestions of lyrics to be projected on pavements and buildings in St Anne's Square between 22nd to 26th May. A civic memorial service attended by families of the victims will also be held at Manchester Cathedral. Last year on June 4th Ariana Grande hosted a tribute concert in Manchester to raise money for those affected by the atrocities on May 22nd. Take that, Justin Bieber, Coldplay, Niall Horn, Usher, Katy Perry, Miley Cyrus and Pharrell Williams and Liam Gallagher took to the stage to raise money for the Red Cross's Manchester Emergency Fund.